Are you saying hi? Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be giving you all my first impressions and review of the base travel bags. I have two items that I purchased, two not four. And I just wanted to show you guys them and give you a little more details about the products. If you've been considering purchasing them, I hope this is helpful for you. So without further ado, let's jump into the video real quickly. Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up this video if you enjoy it, and check out my social media. First up is the DOP kit. So this is a toiletry bag. I got it in this beautiful neutral color. Really like the way this looks. So when you open it up, it is large very large so this large my initial thought was well this isn't that big and then i opened it up and i was like wow this actually is that big so if you aren't aware this line was created by shay mitchell who i really like i'm a big fan so lots of products here everything is super travel friendly here, there is a spot specifically for your toothbrush it says toothbrush perfect for travel i am going to use this underneath space probably about an inch or so tall. My makeup is going to go in there. Toiletries for the family will go in here. It also came with a really cute clear luggage tag. It says, above all else, explore. It says, if found, please catch me at, and you can put your Instagram handle or Twitter, then your name, address, all of that info, which I thought was really cool. It has this to where it can hang onto a little towel rack. So if you don't have much space in a hotel bathroom, you will be able to keep this out. Here it is. I wanted to list a few little details about it, including price. So it's called the Dope Dop Cosmetics Case by Base. It is an 11 and a half inch width, five inch height, and seven inches deep. It retails for $48. Basically, um, Shay Mitchell created this line in 2018, which I think is awesome. It is called B-E-I-S Bays. And here my cute little son is saying hi. Beautiful baby. Do you like the travel kit? Like I said, my first impression, I thought, whoa, that's kind of small. But after opening and looking in there, I put all of my products in there and I was like, whoa, all of my travel essentials fit. So super excited next up is the weekender bag the again base weekend travel tote it retails for 98 dollars same coloring very pretty super neutral so this part which i thought was really clever unzips right here and then it can go on your carry-on sit on it so it's super easy for travel this bottom compartment is entirely for shoes and let me tell you it is pretty big which i was quite excited you could definitely put a few pair of shoes and definitely um, quite a few pairs of sandals as well. It has this removable shoulder strap or you can carry it like this. You also have a regular front handle. When you open it up, it is quite large again and it's pretty structured when you get in there, which I really like. So there is a laptop sleeve compartment, which I thought would be super handy. So you can just pop it out at the airport really quickly and easily. There are other um, storage areas here, a couple pockets and a zipper. There's also this, which I believe is for your keys. So this is pretty big. I definitely think that I will be able to fit mine and my entire family's clothing and shoes in this bag for shorter trips, you know, nothing super major for a long weekend and such. Super excited. So like I said, this retails for $98 and I wanted to give you guys the dimensions of it as well. It is 19 and a half inches wide, 15 inches in height, and 10 and a half inches deep. The interior capacity is considered extra large, 10 inch strap and a 12 to 22 and a half inch convertible strap drop. So that kind of should help you out with size. You could definitely still take it on the airport, but I would say it's a lot just for an overnight bag. Like I would definitely use it more for a weekend trip. Super excited to use it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you did, then be sure to give it a thumbs up. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you all next time. Bye.